Hello again, everybody. I am Jeff. Jeff opens cards with June 22nd rewards claim here on Spillands. So with 14 chests on my name's Jeff. Got 16 SPS. There we go. That's going to be the best chest this guy has had so far uh, in silver chests. It has had a legendary and two epics, I think, within bronze chests and one gold card. Uh, no pack or anything yet, so pretty sure that's the best chest it's gotten since going into silver, at least. And it is eligible for gold now. I uh, got to decide if I want to do that after this video or wait until uh, the reset here uh, and get like extra silver chest one more day or what. But uh, I got 39 stamina built up here. Uh, I can't buy more until like 2 a.m. So uh, I'll, I'll probably, oops. Uh, one. All right. So go to the next. Normally the next is my little cat. Uh, however, uh, I was too slow figuring out what was wrong with his account. I had settings to stop playing at like 300 rating. Because I think last season it was like slow getting to that point and I didn't want to like risk falling below it. So it actually maxed out stamina, didn't earn any chests until after the day reset. He has six chests so far for tomorrow. So, uh, but today, no chests for Milo. My bad. <laughs> Three chests for two thirds. We got eight and a half SPS, 128 merits, and eight and a half SPS. Not too bad. I uh, used to get, you know, less than two SPS in most chests and doing pretty well here. Uh, won five of the last six. Okay, there's the losing streak. Because I'm like, still not in gold one, so must not have done that well over the last 24 hours, but most recently, doing better. Um, I may have to rent some, like, non-modern cards, since we are playing wild. I, I should have chicken all these accounts, I think. Most of them anyway, but uh, I might have to give it a little extra gusto here to break into diamond, but we'll see. We'll see. Move on to the next. Be plumber's quack. Ba-da-boo-ba-da-boo. Middle of the battle, I'm going to pause. All right, after I refresh gold times, I never saw the battle, uh, but it was a loss, you can see, with Llama. Um, the account did break in a diamond recently, but did not stay. Uh, so hopefully it gets back in there, because I, I keep saying, I feel like top of gold is harder than the bottom of diamond. So if you can get into diamond and then you'll not lose the first one when you get in there, because you have a little runway, I feel like you can kind of run to diamond too a lot of times, but... Uh, your are my very. Um, so I was actually way down here, 2800, uh, eight hours ago. And yep, that, that was the only time. And then lost two. So dropped five rain points to go back into gold. Um, and then faced someone with a lower rain. So that one ideally would have won and uh, maybe gotten right back into diamond, but it is what it is. Um, so yeah, how many chests? We got three so far for tomorrow. Today, seven diamond chests for Plumber's Quack, 11 potions, one Swamp Spitter, 13 potions, five Swamp Spitters, 10 potions, 51 merits, and 11 Terracious Grunts. Pretty lackluster there overall. I had the one BCX commons are always kind of deflating, especially in diamond and champ chests, but it happens. It happens. I mean, it used to be that every time you get a common card is one BCX, so... Count our blessings, I guess, that uh, we can get more than one, and we got 11 there in one of them, but uh, knowing that you can get double-digit BCX, it definitely doesn't feel great when you get one BCX commons in the higher level chests now. Um, so Digital Breaker, uh, getting kind of close here, Diamond 1. Uh, six chests so far for tomorrow. Lost three in a row there. Uh, pretty good besides that, and three losses in a row there. But other than those couple of stints, pretty solid. And today we have... Seven chests as well. 51 merits, 16 potions, four fire callers, a pack, seven fungus flaners, all the martyr, two gold, Noah the Just. There we go. There we go. And 9.2 SPS. Um, at this point, FY, I'm probably not doing an end of season recap um, just because we're so deep in the season already. Just with the traveling I was doing, just it wasn't in the cards for this season. I did update my spreadsheets and stuff, and I actually. Uh, documented what I did, but uh, I don't want to, like, not upgrade things either right now, so, uh, you know. So, no the just. Ooh! That gives us a level 3, then. Very nice. And th that gives us dodge, then. Sweet. Sweet, 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 sweet. So, that was a solid get. Um, does this kind of have Kulu, though? Let me do a quick check on that. I think, I think it does. Just, I don't think I have a level 2 Kulu mastermind on any account. I still have one BCX in the main account because I keep pulling Terracious Hulks instead. <sighs> uh, 
mob to do legendary. Do I not? Oh. They don't have Kulu Mastermind on this account yet. I, I care because with Know the Just, I love using that with the Supposed the Wise. I'll often put Know the Just in the two spot um, and Kulu in the three spot with Pasiblis the Wise as a summoner, because uh, then Kulu with Puffin's Train gives him the just uh, two melee attack, and with the Wise uh, summoner, uh, it has reach, so it can actually attack. And also has Rust, which means our opponent will lose two shield and everything, which often makes everyone just open, um, so that anybody with opportunity, Kulu Mastermind, Deep Lurker, and in um, Brawls at least, um, is called Vorst, uh, so three up three monsters that hit pretty hard. Uh, they have that much more easy of a time to trample with Supposed Wise as well. So it's a play I like doing a lot, uh, but you need to have Kulu Mastermind uh, to maximize the utility of No the Just there. So hopefully uh, no later than the next end of season on this account, we can get our first Kulu Mastermind, I guess. But don't have it yet. <laughs> so that makes the the uh, two gold Noah hit a little less a little bit more anticlimactic or whatever, but uh, still a good hit all the same. Just uh, need that extra support piece still to fully maximize its worth. But anyways, on the main account. We've got three chests so far for tomorrow. Uh, still in the middle of champ three. We've we we've been in and out of champ a little bit. I don't think it's been in champ two yet this season. I could be mistaken. Um, won three the last four. Not too shabby. Uh, there's a little bit of losing streak there. Yeah, not, not too shabby. How many we got today? We've got... Ooh, 11 champ chests. Let's find some juice, shall we? Start off with... Less than 2 SPS. <laughs> 27 potions. 15 fire collar. I think 15 is the max. I was thinking it was 14 for a while. Oh, it should be a 3 BCX or the equivalent of like 1 gold. But uh, 15 I think is the highest we've gotten. So, very nice. Uh, less than 2 SPS again. 1 no of the just. Not gold this time, though. Five more fire callers. 3.1 SPS. 2.9 SPS. 1.7 SPS. 4 SPS. And one BCX of fire caller. So three of the 11 chests have fire callers in them. And uh, just kind of got worse. It went 15, 5, and 1. So 21. Uh, that's what? 4 BCX shy of a level 4 fire caller from scratch. <laughs> uh, which, you know. Granted, no one's going to, you know, just jump to champ chest from scratch, but uh, just the fact you can get almost a level 4 common in a single day uh, playing in champ is kind of cool, I guess. Uh, but would have been nice if at least one of these SPS chests was uh, double digits with, you know, before the decimal, but is what it is. And uh, so I'm just going to check the PCX of No the Just while I say subscribe if not already, rock smash that like button. Uh, check links down below and up above in the iCards. I thank you all for watching. And I'll see you next time, whenever and wherever that may be. And we've got 25 No Other Just. We need seven more to gain backfire. See you next time, whenever and wherever that may be.